Kansas City. The scene just a few moments ago, predictably loud and raucous here at Arrowhead as their beloved Chiefs took field, and they are set to match up with the Dallas Cowboys. Out is the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. This fielded at the two. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line. takes the give from Mahomes. Now this will go for five up to the 33. Well, I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half. You've got to take some pressure off of this young quarterback, and no better way to do it than to establish the running game early. Play action, it's Mahomes. Going deep here for Watkins. And they went for a big play through the air on second down. Couldn't connect. Now it's third. Well, that certainly looked like something that they discussed all week in practice, getting ready for this one. Take the big shot right out of the gate. At worst, you'll open up the defense a little bit, loosen them up, have them back on their heels. From the gun on third down, Mahomes. And that is incomplete. Not only was the call spot on, how about the execution of that defense right there? Zone was absolutely locked up tight. He was trying to force it in there on third down. But if there's a time to force it, he felt like he needed to make a play, right? Yeah, exactly right. Third down, you got to try and find something. There's nothing available there for him. Okay, look at this. The punt team nowhere to be found. They're on the sidelines. Offense going to go for this on the opening drive. Ready, green. They do go for it. It's Mahomes. He is going to find Hill here. And he's taken down right at the 45-yard line. So not only do they convert on fourth, but they pick up 22 yards in the process. So after two first downs, they get another here. First and 10 at the 45. Z, 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 Z. Throw it. Watkins, the intended receiver, and that'll bring up second down. Brandon, it looked like he had his hands on it for a moment, but let's face it, that was going to be a tough catch all the way because of the presence of the defense right there as he was trying to haul it in. Yeah, nice job to force the incompletion. Mahomes again here on second and 10. And this one is incomplete. The positioning here is key. As a defensive back, you're taught 99% of the time make a play on the football. But in this case, making a play on the man was all the difference. That's what forced the incompletion. Now they face a third and 10 after back-to-back -back incompletions. Mahomes to throw once more. Under pressure, and he will go down. Sacked back at the 46. And their inaugural sack of the game coming from an unlikely source. You mean it wasn't a linebacker? It wasn't a defensive end? It was somebody like you. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that's a surprise for the offense. That's not what they normally get when they think about pressure. And it appears they'll go for it here on fourth down. A big call on the game's opening drive. Here we go now. Blue 45. Blue 45. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. And he's going to go down again. Demarcus Lawrence coming hard that time. He's able to run him down for a loss of 12. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. 
They go play action here on first down. Oh, he's going to take a shot right away. And this is going to be intercepted. Picked off by the safety here, Ron Parker. And Brandon, this is a real nice job defensively of getting inside a quarterback's head and figuring out, okay, where is he going with the football? Because you can make an educated guess defensively, not all the time, but sometimes. And when you're right, you've got a decent chance of coming away with the football. Kansas City coming back out onto the field. Had the open week after the loss, and now they get back on the balance beam. They're 10 and 2 and rolling again. And they navigate that balance beam like it is the widest highway <laughs> you've ever seen, don't they? They walk with confidence across it. 40 points against the Raiders. And how about their schedule? Three of their last four at home. And I am circling when the Chargers come to town in week 15. A Thursday nighter could be for the division title. Yeah, the other three games, Baltimore, Oakland both at home at Seattle, second last week of the season. And he's got his receiver. That's Sammy Watkins. And he takes this up to the 40-yard line before being corralled. Mahomes to the former Ram, Sammy Watkins for the Kansas City first. down at about the 43 that time. Jalen Smith, the Notre Dame man, in on the tackle. One thing to keep in mind, partner, especially in the second half, and you've got a running back of this size, of these dimensions, I can just tell you, attrition does set in for a defense because you're excited about hitting him in the first half. Maybe not now. so much Green, in the second 90. half, and some Green, of these shorter 90. gains turn into bigger runs later. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. The attempt on the dive, and he has it. What a catch. A good pick up there, 26 yards. I'd have to say that whenever you see a good post route run, they do not like to let it end without the catch. Hence, that great diving play. Yeah, lay it up there, let him go get it, and he got it. Now Mahomes. He's got his man on the comebacker. That's Watkins. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. 11 more on that one, and another first down. Partner, this is one of the best routes anyone can have in their offensive playbook. Tough to defend because you think it's a go route, and then he breaks it back on the comeback. There's one other thing you need as well. A well-thrown ball. Exactly right. You have a guy who has some precision in throwing the football because of the timing of the route. down Mahomes and he fires one that's intercepted Cheetah Bay Aluzie with a pick past the 10 to the 11 yard line and that's where the return stops across the NFL all the buys are done so the 32 Ben Roethlisberger at the top and <laughs> Patrick Mahomes is right on his heel just 22 yards behind and he's the guy that everyone is focused in on he's fun to watch how about the rest of the top five Matt Ryan Jared Goff and Aaron Rodgers the guys toting the ball Todd Gurley leads with 1,175 yards Ezekiel Elliott right under a heavy rush and down he goes Chris Jones He's the one that got to him. He takes him down for a loss of nine. And yeah, they need to work to at least get some of this yardage back after the sack. Second and 19. Out of his end zone, Prescott. And the hit jarred it loose. It's incomplete. Seems like this defense, especially the secondary, has really been contesting about every throw in this first half. Remind me of a good half-court defensive basketball team. Every time a pass is thrown, they're right there in good, good defensive position, able to affect the play. Prescott from his end zone on third. He's going to find his man. That's Tavon Austin. And he gets it to the 30 when it's all said and done. A really good pickup of 28 yards. Here comes the boom. I see you, boy. I see you. Clock running under four to play now as they come up on first and ten. Got three. Got three. Give me three. Give me 
36. They just get the playoff. Now Prescott. And his throw here is incomplete. The intended receiver, Tavon Austin. That'll bring up second down. On that incompletion, since we're hitting the home stretch of the regular season here, wanted to talk about some of the sack leaders on the defensive side of the football. Not too many surprises, really, if you look at the top seven or so. Aaron Donald, he's number one right now, 16 and a half sacks. That just tells you the greatness of Aaron Donald that it's not a surprise to us that he leads in sacks, yet he's mainly a defensive tackle. Usually those guys are not on the top of the leader. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Allen Bailey coming hard that time. He's able to run him down for a loss of 12. They'll need a big play here. Will Dak and the Cowboys after the sack. It's third and long. Now whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside. Cowboys after the sack. It's third and long. Now Prescott. He'll let it fly for Austin. Into double coverage and it's intercepted. Picked off by the free safety, Eric Berry. And they have possession and they have it at the 38-yard line. Here's the Kansas City offense now as they get set to take over. And there are parts of their last drive they'd like to emulate. And, of course, they'd like to forget the inning, the interception. But they did put together, Charles, a nice sustained drive to get him down the field. Yeah, and unfortunately for them, the only thing that matters is part two, right? Because once they threw the interception and finished off the drive, that does them no good to go back and say, well, you know, we had a good one going. Finish things off. That's the only way you can get it done. Meanwhile, they take a shot to start the drive, but this is going to wind up incomplete. They work again from the 38 on second and 10. On the ground, this is where. They get six here after the incompletion, and it'll leave them with a third and four. And there's a run to be happy with. Good, solid yardage. You'll take that any time you hand the ball to a back. Ready! Blue 45! Blue 45! They fake the give. Now Mahomes. Looking for Watkins, and it's intercepted. Cheetah Bay Awuzie with a pick. And now off to the races, down the right side. And he will score. Touchdown, Cowboys. That was an interception, but on the field, the guys who are picking it off, they're not saying that. What word are they using? It's Oski. <laughs> and that means catch the ball and go the other way. That's your vernacular. I've never heard anybody say Oski. Ask around. They'll tell you. Extra point right down the middle. And the decision to just kick the extra point winds up successful. Well, we looked at each other right away. We knew that flag was coming out. And I always enjoy the conversation post because officials always tell you, I don't want to throw the flag, but you caused the play. You did it. I had to. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. And this offensive unit ready to do battle again. They're sort of seeing themselves spiral out of control. Let's see if they can get things back on track. And this is where the coach is walking go, that line of being calm and really being firm with his team. Add one, tell me once, you know, when we're having a tough patch, this two shall pass, this two shall pass. And then finally we kept having a rough patch. He said, but you got to do something <laughs> Heads up. to make it pass. And that's what they have to do. They've got to get some control back. Get the well, Mahomes can't get away, and down he goes. Demarcus Lawrence in there to pick up his second sack now of the afternoon. Sacks, a growing theme in this first half. This is second and long. Working from the gun, Mahomes. And able to 
get this across the 20 before going out of bounds. Eight yards on the completion, but now they face third down. Never make the mistake that the slot receivers, especially the little guys like we're watching here, are just quicker than fast. A lot of them combine quickness and speed, and they catch a lot of footballs, as we just saw there. Here's Mahomes to throw. They're going deep for Hill. So they took a shot there on third down, couldn't get it. Now it's four. Sure, that pass was incomplete as they made an attempt to get a big one downfield, but that's okay because the second part of that is if you don't get the completion, at least you've told the defense you're trying to stretch them out a little bit, and they may have to change accordingly. Now look at this, fourth and 12, and they're going to line up to go for it. They'll try and throw for it here. And for the third time here in this half, it's intercepted. Picked off by Jordan Lewis. And he will score. Touchdown, Cowboys. So they go on fourth down. Not only do they not get it, it turns into six points the other way. Disastrous. And many people think you should just go ahead and knock it down in that situation. Turn it over for the offense. But I had a defensive coordinator recently tell me, we see that as a passive play. We don't do that anymore. We want the ball in our hands, and we want to head the other way. It's probably also instinct a lot of times. If you see a lot of green grass ahead of you, go ahead and grab it. It's the exact right play to do. That's knowing when to break the rules and when to make a play that maybe you hadn't been taught. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. This is taking about seven yards. will only get back to the 16-yard line. So now here are the Chiefs as their offense makes their way back out onto the field. They are looking to make a bit of a 180. They are sputtering right now. And frankly, I think it's time to call your playmakers together and say, all right, guys, we're going to lean on you through this patch. We need you to get us back on track and get us going in the right direction. So you're calling. Oh, this is taken in. It's complete. And all the way down to the 40-yard line. A big play there just before halftime. 44 yards. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield to the 40 now for first and 10. Hey, hey. Green, 39. Green, 39. Mahomes now on first down. And the Cowboys pressure gets there this time for the sack. Taco Charlton, he's the one that got to him. He takes him down for a loss of nine. Sacks, a growing theme in this first half. This is second and long. Now here's Mahomes. That one complete to Hill. And yeah, he'll get it inside the 40 to the 39. Now whistles and a timeout with three seconds left in the first half. So three seconds here remain in the half. On is the field goal unit to see about getting three points. This will be from 56 yards out. That's running out of steam and it won't get there. He left it just short. No good. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. The Cowboys will get the football first here, and they have the lead as well as we are underway in quarter three. Cooper on the return. Solid return, pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32-yard line. Out come the Cowboys now as they'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. This is sort of what you would call a put-away drive, isn't it? They score here, especially a touchdown. It's almost out of reach. It certainly feels that way, and I think that they're going to call their plays accordingly because what you really want to do, even though you know the scoreboard is still up there and the game's going to go on, you think you can take the spirit away from another team, that their drive and will to come back and win can be taken with another score right here. That's still pretty cool. Flushed out right. He'll get five out of the scramble. It's second down. 
How about a tip of the cap to the defense? They're working against a very mobile quarterback, but all day long they've kept him under wraps. And on that play, they held him to a short gain. Second down, Prescott. And he'll hit the slant route. That's caught by Cooper. And he's got this to the 30 before being taken down. A gain of 32 that time. Well, partner, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play. They picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. A first down carry by Elliott. And he will lose yardage here to the 31-yard line. That's going to go as a loss of a yard, and it'll be second down. So statistically, both of these offenses having a rough time getting a running game going. But boy, what a nice play there defensively. Tackling him behind the line, but you're right. You look at the numbers. Neither side looks on track in the ground game. A second down throw for Prescott. Oh, he's able to outmuscle him here as he pulls.